हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स हाउ आर यू आई एम विकास ड्राइंग इंस्ट्रक्टर फ्रॉम विकास ड्राइंग स्कूल इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू हाउ इज योर ड्राइंग टेस्ट इज गोइंग टू बी टुडे आई हैव जोशी विद मी ही हैज अ ड्राइंग टेस्ट जस्ट आफ्टर वन आवर एंड आई एम गोइंग टू गिव हिम वन मॉक टेस्ट एंड आफ्टर दैट वी गोइंग फॉर अ ड्राइंग टेस्ट सो आई एम गोइंग टू चेक हिज ड्राइंग एंड आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन अबाउट द ड्राइंग टेस्ट टिप्स एंड द ड्राइंग टेस्ट पर procedure and what thing he need to be very extra careful so uh, joshi do you bit have bit experience in driving or yeah you? yeah yes i have experience i had overseas over the lesson yep. i am drive i drive there at least for 15 years oh that means you have a very good experience of driving you already know how to drive a car yes, yes, yes. so you just need a brush up and yes, uh, yes. that that should be very really fine Okay, this is the only your second lesson today in Melbourne, or you took some lesson from the. Ah, uh, it's you can say it's third lesson. Third lesson. Yes. Or oh, you took one lesson from someone. Someone, my my son actually. Okay, okay, he trained you. Yes, uh, yes. And after that, you took one lesson from me yesterday, and this is your third lesson. Third lesson. So that is really good. So you did you watch over any YouTube videos? Yes, so many times. I that is very useful. That, that is, is really useful and helpful. Uh, yes, okay. very helpful. Thank you, thank you so for so much for watching. So, my dear friend, if you have a driving test very soon, please don't forget to subscribe this channel and like and share with your friends because I am going to post the video regularly on the weekly basis. So, you're going to get latest information from the first. Uh, so, let's start with the pre-driving safety check. So, left indicator, please. right indicator please indicator off please show me headlight please yep this is high beam so you need to pull toward you first so for a headlight you don't need to push back you just need to turn your indicator two time so this is parking light you keep it on off everything so headlight on so this is headlight show me high beam this is high beam high beam off if you want to keep it high beam off don't don't turn just push back again okay just pull toward you the indicator pull toward you okay like this understand can mm -hmm. we do it again ha huh. so uh, switch off everything now because your your car is on high beam so so you what you need to do you, you just need to go low like okay. this show me headlight no no Don't don't push back. Headlight just turn two time, or high beam. Just push toward your feet, and high beam off. Just push toward you. Okay, that's how how high beam is going to be off. Okay. So head headlight off. Washroom wiper. Washroom wiper. This one is washroom wiper. Just pull toward you. Very good. Show me front dimmer. The front dimmer picture is same like. Show me back dimmer. Show me hazard light. So this is the hazard light. Show me handbrake. Show me brake. Show me horn. Very good, well done. Show me front dimmer again. Back dimmer again. Hazard light again. Washroom wiper again. Show me headlight again. No. High beam, please. I be move your yeah, headlight off one more time back so now when you feel safe when you ready take a quick road exit please make sure before moving you must need to give your indicator right take your next left take your next left into left line You don't need to go in the middle and just directly turn left. Take okay. your next left. Okay. 
left indicator left shoulder check i think you forget to wear your seat belt oh so sorry take the next left but yeah, don't worry if in the test this thing happen so you don't need to worry just we keep going straight we will we, and uh, we going to park somewhere and then we will do this seat belt so keep going straight Touch the straight line. Okay. So pull lever behind this car, please. Very good, well done. So if in the test this thing happen, mm -hmm. so you just, just don't need to worry about anything. So keep going straight and find a safe place. Somewhere and just pull over and then then uh, wear your pull seat belt. That, pull over is good. Pull over, pull over is good. Very good. Well done. Take your next right again, please. Take the end of the straight, turn left. Of the straight turn right make sure start to give your indicator little early like a three second before three house before take a next left straight turn right take a next left but this is permanent line we can't cross this we cannot uh, yes. you can cross this one if if the car is parked at left hand side and uh, there is a no space so okay. you can go in the middle okay so we're going to do 3.10 please when you feel safe This one we are doing cup to cup 3.10 Very good, well done, very good shoulder check
better to go a little bit never take a risk if you don't feel safe you we'll go a bit more back okay i understand so three point turn is very good well done you uh, you did very good this one we did cup to cup three point turn uh, how many indicator in cup to cup three point turn left right and then back back, back rear shoulder check well yes. good well done so cup to cup uh, take a next left cup to cup three point turn we don't need to enter in the driveway we just need to do cup to cup so will there will going to be two indicators first one is going to be left indicator left. and second is going to be right indicator and then reverse and go back again do a reverse pella parking behind the next car please okay Half, half left. Remember, I teach you only half. Yes. That much. You need to remember. Rear shoulder check. You forget to check. No, not from here. From here. Okay. No need to turn. No need to turn your wheel. And remember, second step. I I, I told you when you touch the curve. This that, red one. This red one. This red line. When when you going to touch to the curve, then you need to stop your car. keep your car very slow no rush anything no this is a gutter line after the gutter line there is a curve yes you can stop now and then turn your wheel full right till lock and just keep going back keep keep going back until your car become straight turn your wheel full right so keep going back until your car become straight so once you once your car become straight then stop and then start to move forward and stop we we'll keep it a 2 3 meter distance from the next car then park your car in a parking once you finish park your car like that okay so this is very good for reverse parallel parking only you need to be very care careful about your cg you need to turn your wheel half left okay okay make sure don't turn too much if you will turn too much your car will go somewhere else okay so this you you can follow this technique because uh, if you know how to do it you can use that one but i i told a check yesterday you are struggling so i show you my technique only turn your wheel half left just remember that thing. okay thank you so keep going sh straight please when you feel so safe very good well done very good shoulder check so when you feel safe when you ready please pull lever make sure when you pull lever make sure don't touch the curb don't hit the curb uh, and once you finish park your car in a parking okay that's how you need to pull and you need to keep your left indicator on make sure left indicator left. once you pull lever you need to give your left indicator and then pull lever before lever. starting i give it but i when it is uh, we did not finish it it will keep on it automatically off okay so but you need to give it again okay if it's get automatically off make sure keep it on when you pull lever okay okay keep going straight please when you feel safe but this pull lever is not good it's so right not too bad so they they not that much strict if you will park little bit here little bit there you pull over they don't mind very good well done very good shoulder check end of the straight turn left 
they will uh, go for uh, either parallel reverse parallel parking or uh, three turn take a next stop yes they 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 going to say to you one of the uh, one of the thing uh, either they going to say to you do a three point turn or reverse parallel parking so you need to keep your indicator on again if it's get off you make sure don't forget to give you give again so do a u turn please from this roundabout okay very good well done so in the driving test if you don't understand uh, uh, make sure ask again so they will repeat again they, okay. they will say to you don't uh, don't 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 get confused and uh, and uh, uncomfortable make sure hesitation for asking ask again can you repeat please so they will repeat for you and i will repeat for you as well so keep going straight please from this roundabout Take a next left. Sure, don't start to increase. 70. If you see the 70 sign, don't start to increase your speed limit okay. straight away. You need to increase your speed limit after the sign. right line please when you feel safe make sure when i say to you line changing and, and when the examiner they say to you don't rush and okay. don't slow down for a line changing don't slow down keep it do, do it on the sa same speed if you can do it otherwise keep going straight okay. driving on 45 move to left line please when you feel safe don't slow down don't slow down don't slow down make sure keep your keep your indicator on keep your indicator on and just do shoulder check and when you feel safe do it very good well done so when you when i say to you make sure don't I slow understand. down you slow down make sure give your indicator and just wait for the safe gap indicate take a next traffic light turn left indicator doesn't mean you need to do it immediately so do it when you feel safe if you don't feel safe don't do it take a next left into right line please medium strip please
Next right from traffic light, please. From here or from there? Yeah, from here. Go a little bit forward. Go a little bit forward. Start here. Okay. Then right into left line. So directly go to left line. Okay, from here you don't need to give indicator. Directly go to left line. Move to right line, please. When you feel safe, make sure you're making a mistake when you're line changing. You know, start start to follow your speed limit first. Check your speed limit. There is a heads up display as well. You can clearly see the this speed limit. So make sure start to increase. Don't do it on slow speed because the people they are coming on 70, 80, and sometimes even more than that. Suppose if you will slow down and if you will line change, what will happen? So they will beep you. They will horn you. It could be accident as well because you're driving slow. And when you line changing, you you drop your speed limit. So when you feel safe, when you're ready, move to left line, please. Very good, very good. Make sure line for I, I tell you the line changing uh, tip. So line changing, don't do it on slow speed. Do it even little bit extra speed. Okay. Okay. Do it on little bit extra. So give it a little bit extra. Push a little bit hard little bit accelerator so your speed will be little bit more and once you feel safe then do it move look left line and merge right line so start to don't slow down make sure Coming. indicator give your indicator straight away and after giving indicator no need to rush anything uh, so people they sometime people there is going to be very high chance to get a safe gap because when the people they see your indicator they start to give you give way some people they start to slow down some people they will over speed so they're going to be very high chance to get a safe gap all most of the students some students what they do they they try to see the safe gap and then they give indicator and sometimes they're not able to change the line so examiner fail them because they even not trying how they going to know you trying they're going to know by your indicator when you're going to give your indicator then examiner is going to know oh you you trying but uh, indicator sometimes they get they, in a student they they have a misunderstanding about the indicator they think if they have they they, they they they're going to give their indicator they need to change immediately take a next right from traffic light please So this is uh, we are on the giveaway traffic light, uh, okay. not a giveaway traffic no, light. Sorry, give this is not a giveaway traffic light because here is an arrow uh, as well yes. and light as well. But sometime it's become giveaway traffic light. Arrow go automatically and no, just. No, I need to go on that side or this side. This side. This side. This side. This, not this side. Uh, this just uh, just another side. No, not this side. Not this, this side. Look, there yeah. is a two sides. Make sure when you see the two two sides, use your common understanding. Only always divide. Oh, one line is for going straight, straight and one line is for going back. So if you will understand and if you will think about like that, then you will understand about the lines. And you can see. Oh, this is the line. Even there is an, the uh, the two vehicle cannot go at a, a, and this line. So then you will understand. There should be another line. Then you will realize. Oh, this is the like intersection. So that is going to be another side of the, yes. the that uh, that that uh, that concrete cement side. Make sure in a roundabout always first one check do it a little bit early yes. and the second check is when you go close.
Taking next left again, please. I should not forget to do re left shoulder check okay. because we're crossing the bicycle line. Always, whenever you're crossing the bicycle line, you must need to do left. Do a U turn, please. Your left, left indicator. Make sure when you're doing a U turn, yes. because for making a U turn, first we need to go pull our left hand side to make a big circle and then we need to give your right indicator and make sure before moving right you need to do right shoulder check and then if safe to do so you can start to move take your next right again please Next straight, we're going to turn left. Make sure you need to start to move from there and start to do left shoulder check here. Yes, I did. Yes. And what is speed limit here? Check. Yeah, this course. Okay, sorry, forget. Yeah, yeah. Make, make sure most of the stu students miss ah, this, this, uh, this speed sign because this is a uh, Belfast Street but not a fast street. street. Student, they think uh, uh, it's a speed limit is 50 here because uh, the speed limit just in a corner and the street look very big and they try to follow the 50 and you are you doing the same thing as well make sure speed limit is 40 here keep it around 35 or 32 something uh, so make sure if you see any 50 sign can we come again to take, this road yes take it next left again please so start to increase your speed limit after the sign not before the sign after the sign okay yes after the sign always you need to you need to start to decrease your speed limit before the sign and you need to increase after the sign so for example if you see there is a 40 sign and we're driving on 50 50 john then you need to start to slow down little little bit before before uh, to before entering the 40 your speed should be 40 and take a next left and for example if you if you're driving on 50 and you see the speed limit is changing to 60 make sure don't yeah so first we do it here so stop sign make sure when you're doing a stop when you're turning left first make your position left hand side like that stop full, full stop full stop keep your foot on the brake yes full stop like that dead stop and then no, check. not to change this no need to change yes check both side and then you can go very good well done so we're going to turn next right again please very good well done so i was just saying uh, if you uh, you need to decrease before and you need to increase after the sign suppose if you for example if you see a 60 sign and you're driving on a 50 john so you can give way to that person yes. so you need to increase your speed limit after the 60 sign end of this straight turn left very good well done very good stop it's not coming what he says yeah he if somebody just flashing you take an next right that means they're giving you give way okay. i think india is uh, different if somebody yes, somebody yes, flash you 
you i will go first that yes. means but here is a uh, opposite if somebody flashing you that means they giving you give back okay. so you go play first play end of the straight turn left we're going to take next right again please from okay. this roundabout and make sure try to look this mirror as well little bit you can go that car that van was too far but it's better to wait yes this this van is coming okay. very good well done Take the next right, right, keep it straight and right. Take the next left. Take the next right. Take a next left. You see some improvement today? Yeah, yeah, I can see uh, it's a very big uh, improvement in your driving. Today you're doing all the head checks very good. Stops and you stopping. 3.10 you did very good. Reverse parallel parking you did very good. So take a next right again, please. So I see just only thing is we need to improve in line changing. Line changing because it's your habit to slow down and change a line. So make sure don't slow down. Only you can go because no one is that car is too far. No, let him let him. Let him. <laughs> but that car was too far. Too far only we, only if you see a three second gap, that is safe gap. Even if 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 you little bit a, a little bit nervous driver. Yeah, but suppose so, I left it this car. Is it a minus point for me? Because I look, waited for a long time. They, they can mark you for that. Because you know, because it was a completely safe gap. Okay. That means you don't have a judgment. Understand. Take a next right. Your observation is not good. So they're going to mark you for that. Because if it's safe, then quickly go. Even you can use, if you feel the car is coming closer to you, give a little bit extra accelerator. So turn a little bit fast. Okay. Instead of going slow, you can turn a little bit fast and you can maintain that gap. So speed limit is 50 here because we are in a residential area. The residential area, the speed limit is 50. So end of this straight turn left place. Make sure little bit check this mirror. Very important to check. Most common mistake students they're doing, they're not checking this mirror. 
they're not checking the center mirror and they they lose lots of points so if you want to get some extra point and you want to pass your driving test make sure now don't forget to check your center mirror take a next left always check your uh, center mirror whenever you pressing the bra brake check before or after the pressing the brake but must you need to check it when whenever you press normally you need to check it whenever you pressing your first then you need to check mirror then brake because the reason of checking the center mirror is so we can see the backside traffic how fast they they coming and so we can press our brake accordingly uh, but if you don't have a habit make sure check it after or before or check it after 5 second so it will uh, it, it will help you to build your confidence it will complete the testing requirement and uh, take a next left and the driving will be very easy for you because you will be aware of your front side traffic and the back side traffic and the side traffic as well because the center mirror is going to show you the over, overall traffic view so here is a stop sign so you need to stop your car just one meter behind that thick line stop your car here make sure and keep your left indicator on make sure that car is coming then you you but you said you said you count three skips move, move to right line please and feel safe move to right line please i next traffic light turn right so I, I will tell you what you need to do what you what mistake you made this is give it this is called give it you need to stop your car in the center of this intersection i understand i understand yeah, i understand, yes, yes. I understand. So that, uh, that that intersection you fail to give way. So I said to you, if you three second gap, that is safe gap. Yes. Three second means one, two, three. Yes, three this second is, gap. This, but, is, this is three second. Yep. Yes, this is three second. Yes. Make sure keep your car in right hand side, right line. The left hand side is a bike line and parking line. Only right hand side is for driving. When there are two two lanes, one is for parking, other for driving. Driving. Yes. Take a next left. Next left. Do left shoulder check. Left shoulder check because there is a bicycle bicycle line. Oh. So 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 I said it to you. If you see a three second gap, that is safe gap. But you need to turn fast as well because take a next left. That car was coming on sixty kilometer per hour, and front of that car you 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 turning very slow. front of that car you turning very slow so make sure if you see little bit short gap then you need to maintain your speed as well okay, you need to turn little bit fast as well because if you're not going to turn fast then how are you going to maintain the safe gap if you will not able to maintain the safe gap that means you are failed to give way take a next right Make sure you keep your right indicator on. When you feel safe, when you're ready, move to left line, please. Make sure if uh, no one is behind of you, then you can slow down, no problem. But if someone is just behind of you, keep on straight view, don't slow down, speed limit is 60 here. You don't need to do 40. On the main, if the road is very clear, then you need to follow the speed limit as well. You cannot drive 10 less. If you're going to ten, drive 10 less, they, then uh, they're going to mark you, you driving too slow.
only you don't need to follow the speed limit if the road is very congested there is a traffic road is very narrow but if the road is very clear and no one is there then start to follow your speed limit next traffic light turn left so if they say to you next traffic light turn start to move left line because left line but there is no traffic light there is no traffic light so i said uh, next traffic light turn left first make a uh, planning because left line will go left because we are in a right line uh, next traffic light turn left into middle line please so check right hand side and that the straight side sometime people they only check right hand side and they forget to check their straight side and they fail to give way and here the people they stop their car on the pedestrian crossing make sure you need to stop your car after the pedestrian crossing look there is a one car space after the pedestrian crossing no 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 no, no you need to stop your car here after this pedestrian crossing here go little bit forward little bit more forward like here so you can go now safe gap yeah, because you no know, middle line we can go because that car is going on right line okay do you understand where we need to stop now yes so if if there is a space after the pedestrian crossing stop there and if there is already one car there stop behind that pedestrian crossing and uh, make sure don't forget to give your ind you forgetting your indicators sometimes your indicator get off but you you forget okay. to give it again so make sure keep in the mind indicator is a critical error it's a major mistake even you will miss it one time that is one mistake two time if you done and three time that you will be out of the game so move to right line please when you feel safe don't slow down don't slow down that is very big mistake Ma maintain your speed limit Man do it on the same speed press accelerator press accelerator don't don't worry about line check speed limit is 80 here first follow the speed limit move right line please when you feel safe don't slow down don't slow down don't slow down don't, don't slow down move 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 right line please when you feel safe don't slow down don't maintain maintain speed limit do right shoulder check no no car is coming no no that is too far and same speed and then do you need to do like this okay same speed and you need to turn a little bit and then how you need to line change make sure line changing you're doing very big mistake if you want to pass your driving test make sure do it on the same speed by saying a menu name such as go to navigation or go to phone i'm so sorry i'm having trouble understanding use the screen controls or press the talk button to try again okay so we will do a little bit of practice of the line changing because line changing is not doing good yes make a u turn please make a u turn in this braking this medium stripe uh, make sure we not allowed to make a u turn from traffic light we need to do it in this uh, yes. little bit braking so you can do it because the car no one is coming so you have a safe gap and you have opportunity to do it make sure when you feel safe and opportunity then do it quickly then don't wait so move to right lane please after this u turn we can go either in the left or right which yes, way yes yes if they don't say to you anything you can choose any line okay so for a line changing don't slow down do it on same speed or even do it on little bit i know what you doing like it's a very big mistake okay just you are line in a right. you are in a right line suddenly you came to left line make sure that is a very dangerful and it's a very big mist make sure, make sure like this this traffic light like a, we don't have a time to stop our car so we don't need to stop we can we can go we can no, continue yellow. yellow light doesn't mean you need to stop yellow light means you need to be prepared to stop if you have a time if you don't have a time to stop make sure keep going straight
okay so because this time we press very hard brake so uh, this type of this situation it's better to go yellow light doesn't mean you need to stop all the time you need to stop only if you have a time if you see, if you are a little bit away from the traffic light and from too far you see light is changing then better to stop because if you are very close like uh, if you are only 3 second away then you need to make a planning you can go on the right line please when you feel safe make sure don't slow down don't change a line don't worry about line change usually don't worry finished indicator go straight first maintain your speed speed is 80 here you cannot do line changing on this 60 first may try to try to maintain your speed try to maintain your speed first give a little bit hard accelerator so you can reach to 70 very good move to right line please when you feel safe and then do it so same speed even do it a little bit extra speed as i said don't release your foot from the accelerator because you are releasing and your speed is getting drop and that's why you not able to find a safe gap move to left line please when you feel safe don't slow down don't slow down give your indicator shoulder check and go like this look you need to maintain the gap accelerator Uh, when I, when I, when this be sound is coming then i'm giving accelerator okay okay so you 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 you're trying to using your brake but i'm using accelerator so move to right line please when you feel safe and don't try to turn your wheel when i say to you move to right line just take time little bit theek hai joshi ji take time don't rush okay. when i say to you move to left line just maintain Take your time. Do it when to you feel safe. To see the situation. To see the situation. See the situation because you're not seeing the situation. When I say to you straight away, you just start to yes. move, and st straight away you start to slow down. When I say to you anything, you need to give your indicator. See the situation. When you feel safe, then do it. Otherwise, you don't need to do it. Move to left line, please. When you feel safe, make sure give your indicator. Ah, yes, yes. Indicator. Give your indicator. But no, no rush. No rush. No, no. no. But this is a red light. Yeah, no need to. We don't need to do it. Don't do it close to the traffic light. But keep yes. keep going straight. Close to the traffic light. Switch off your indicator and yes, try yes. again. Left indicator again. No rush. Why are you rushing? Because the car is just there. Why are you rushing? And don't worry. Look straight as well. You need to check. You need to check your speed as well. Give your indicator. Give your indi keep your indicator on so the people they. Uh, So so doesn't matter cars safe. are coming doesn't back. matter safe or not safe give your indicator on because when you going to give your indicator the people they going to start to notice you make sure look straight check your speed keep looking safe gap as well and do left shoulder check when you feel safe make sure don't press brake joshi ji accelerator accelerator you need to give your accelerator do left shoulder check when you feel safe Right line, please. When you feel safe, no, no, don't worry. Speed, speed. Remember, speed. Eighty here. Right in. In where is indicator? Where is indicator? Shoulder check. And after complete shoulder check, then do it slowly. Go many blunders. Problem line changing. Line changing, yes. Line changing uh, and maintain the speed maintain. Speed. Line changing, like especially whenever I am saying to you, you yes. getting panic. Get 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 panic. You getting panic. Uh, so you you want to do immediately. Mm. Uh, you don't need to do immediately. Do it when you feel safe. If you don't feel safe, don't do it.
major part will come in this 20 minutes driving 20 minutes yes follow follow make sure follow your speed limit because you're checking surrounding but you're not following your speed limit what time is your driving test 9:25 oh 9:25 then we will go back the state no yes yeah, keep going straight just relax and take a deep breaths <laughs> and uh, and try to see the clear picture and understand what i'm trying to say to you and what mistake you doing mainly i'm doing mistake in that lane changing and um, speed maintenance the speed maintain you're not maintaining the speed yes because when i say to but you but we are not uh, used to drive so fast so fast yeah, yeah. that's right How many times she will ask uh, for this? Normally, they ask. They're going to ask you for the line changing. For two, three times. Five, six times. Five, six times. Very good, well done. Keep going straight. Uh, first, I need to go to Arpitu. Yeah, now, now we're going papers. back to Vic Road. Uh, so we need to go to Vic Road uh, Vic, in, inside the Vic Road. Then they're going to ask you your docu documents like your passport, proof of dress, debit card, and then they're going to ask you a couple of basic questions like uh, COVID related. Have you been tested positive? You need to say no. Uh, no, but I got no. this vaccinated certificate. So you got a vaccination certificate as well. That's very good. So they're going to ask you some COVID question. Have you been tested COVID? Uh, co like a covid positive and then they're going to ask you uh, are you feeling bit cold flu uh, anything then you're going to say you know and then they're going to ask you have you been overseas for last 14 days uh, and, uh, and then they're going to ask you then they're going to take you inside and uh, they're going they're going to explain you about a driving test and they're going to ask you have uh, do you take uh, any medicine uh, do you take any medicine anything no, no. No, the, uh, yeah, that's, uh, they're going to ask you. Uh, and uh, the, the, then they're going to ask you about your uh, your uh, overseas license has been ever suspended or cancelled. So, so they're going to ask you. And then they're going to ask you about uh, you, your... Uh, about the, uh, about the, Yeah, keep going straight. About the driving test. Uh, driving test will be half an hour. There will be two stages of the driving test. First will be 10 minutes. Second will be 20 minutes. First stage they're going to say to you do a 3.10 or reverse parallel parking and then pull over second stage little bit more busier line changing and they will bring you back to Victor. Keep going straight with what you. Are, what your speed so is 80? This means this is 80 or no? Yes, yes, 80. It means 80. Yes. Okay. Move to left line, please, when you feel safe. Make sure if the speed limit 
you driving on 70 change a line changing on 72 73 okay. but that, that zone was 80 80 it yeah, means do it a little bit faster oh, okay because you have it to do a little bit slow down i'm saying by line for a line changing do it on little bit on extra speed don't do it on slow speed on the right line please you feel safe very good well done now you're doing line changing very good well done uh, that is very big improvement i can see in your driving i think some uh, like uh, some something can hit in your mind so you just get used to it now move to left line please when you feel safe now you know i don't need to rush anything i just need to give my indicator and when i will safe i will do it otherwise i will keep going straight close to the traffic light close to the intersection you don't need to do it because the intersection there is a solid line and uh, it's a bit complicated as well so close to the traffic light don't do it try again after the traffic light or after any intersection round about anything if you see some student they see oh light is coming so i need to do it now I will change. Yeah, move right line please when you feel safe. When you feel safe, when you're ready, move to left line. Make sure don't start to because yes, 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 even yes. I haven't said to you anything, you just try trying to go to another line. Make without sure, any indicator without any indicator make sure and after giving in to your indicator wait for three seconds don't do it immediately now you see uh, i will try to change yep. uh, lane but you just watch yeah, just watch. I will you just don't watch. say it. Now I change. Will, yes, I will. You not, just see. Yes, I will just watch how you're going to react. Yes. And uh, make sure do your best. Make sure don't do it on slow speed. Yes, I will try to do this. When I see uh, when I see fail gap, uh, safe gap, then I, I will change. Then you will change. Otherwise, don't rush. That otherwise I will not rush. Uh, yeah. Left line, please, when you feel safe. Very good, well done, very good line changing. So keep going straight, please, when you feel safe. Now, again, I will change. First, follow the speed limit. Look, 80 here. You you just worried about line changing. You're not worried about following the speed limit. Okay, you okay, need to okay. follow the speed limit as okay. well. Other, otherwise, the backside traffic, they will start to move to another line. And some people they will beep you and the, the examiner is going to see and they're going to fail you because you're di distracting other road user. You're not driving safely. So you need to keep in mind everything. everything. You cannot focus just on a line yeah, changing. Line change. You need to focus on your speeding. You need to focus on line changing. So everything you need to do it. Very good. Well done. Right line, please, when you feel safe. Very good, well done.
traffic light and right from left line please. Means this one which between between that two yes. over this. Yes, no. yes. Over no, not between these two. Over. These two with that white car will be go. You need oh, to go over oh, that line. Yes, yes. That is for left. Uh, this that is, is for, for right hand side line. Yep. I understand. Are you feeling good now? No, no. You think you can pass your test now? Yeah, I think. I hope so. <laughs> yeah, you're doing very good. Well done. So make sure don't rush. Okay, okay. Whatever you do, if uh, if uh, if the examiner they say to you anything, don't uh, don't take a pressure on your mind. Don't mm. don't get a burden anything. You need to do it when you feel safe. Even you don't need to follow their instruction mm. because it's a driving test. It's not a navigation test. Okay, this whole, okay. the the student they get a panic when they when they sit. Say to them many things. Suppose they say to them three point turn, reverse parallel parking, line changing. They try to do immediately. Mm -hmm. They don't take the time. They don't. They they don't. They don't take time to thinking, observing, and then moving. They only when they say to them, they only moving. So take a little bit time whenever they say to you, and don't try to make immediately. Even whatever they say to you, always follow three second. After three second, then do it. Traffic light, turn left. Very good, turn left. Left here, we throw. Left here. And then turn right again into parking area and just park your car anywhere wherever you feel safe indicator indicator parking area as well you need to give your indicator and then just park I will try to park. indicator right indicator now make sure parking area as well you need to give your indicator No, no, I will try to. No, no, that's fine. I will do reverse for you. Okay, now, okay, okay. Parking car time. So um, th after parking, just no need to do anything. Hand no, brake on, okay. automatically on. So thank you, thank you so much for watching, my dear friends. If you really uh, get some value, is very helpful. Uh, if you uh, really, really uh, get some uh, value from this uh, video, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and next. share with your friends so they can pass their driving test as well. Thank you, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you soon with the next video. So we're going for a driving test now, and after that, if he will pass, I will post this uh, his picture as well. Uh, so so you can check with the that type of the mistake people they also can pass the test thank you thank you so thank much thank you Vikaji. thank you very much